We're back here 948. It's Friday. That means it's time to check out what's happening this weekend. And Minnesota Live executive producer Mike Marcotte is here with a roundup. Hi. Good morning well, to Michael. you both. Yeah, let's get started. We're going to start at Hutchinson for the Minnesota Pottery Festival. Take a look at all this stuff on the table. There's 15 different potters and artists represented just here on this table. And they're going to have 39 different artists from 10 different states at this event on Saturday and Sunday in oh, Hutchinson. Nice. Just an hour west of the Twin Cities, right? So Clay Coyote is out in Hutchinson. They're going to close down their store. They're going to be at the event this weekend. But uh, Morgan and Clay Coyote, they make great stuff. We featured them both here on Minnesota Live and Twin Cities Live before. Uh, yeah. Uh, Chris, this item is from Omaha, a place that's near and dear to your Yes, heart, it right? is. Wife's hometown. Yep, Potter's from Omaha. Beautiful. And then this piece over here next this to you. Thing? Yep, uh-huh. That's from North Carolina. And they're going to be firing that this weekend at the event. This is neat. The, well, they're cool? all amazing. Yeah. Uh, this looks old. It looks like it, you pulled it out of an Egyptian tomb or something, It's right? so cool. Hmm. Yeah, and it's crazy. So we mentioned this in the tease here a couple minutes ago. On Saturday, or on Sunday, I believe, at noon, each person uh, will get three pounds of play, clay for an amateur throwing competition. Oh, fun. So you get three pounds of clay and five minutes to throw the tallest vase, and then there's also another competition for the widest bowl. Are you good at I bet that's throwing hilarious. pottery? I yeah, bet that'd I'm be sure. Funny. That'd be super We should funny. do that next year on the that'll show. Be, we should do that on the show. Yeah, that'll we'll be set fun. up a tarp. Sure. We'll have you throw yep. some clay. It's very yep. ghost-esque of, yep. of us. Um, there's also food trucks, uh, local brewery and winery serving beverages as well. It's free to attend. And it, they also have golf cart shuttles if you have trouble getting around. Fun. Oh, so it's on Hutchinson. Love Hutch? Yeah, go check it out this weekend. I've been doing that for 12 years. If you're looking for a theater production to check out this weekend, let's go to Litchfield. The community theater out there has their summer musical going on. It's Joseph in the amazing Technicolor dream coat. Cool. Great music. Mm -hmm. Andrew Lloyd Webber's, this Legendary. soundtrack is killer good. They have performances Thursday through Saturday at, at 7 p.m. and then again Sunday at 2 p.m. Uh, and we all know the story of Joseph uh, based on the Bible story of Jacob's sons and Joseph and that amazing Technicolor dream coat that you see there on your screen. 70 cast members a part of this show. Mm, that's a I big pro production in Litchfield. Yeah, that's Litchfield. incredible. Yeah. Yeah. Tickets for the show start at $15. All right. With the hot weekend coming up, all, the All Pints North Summer Brew Fest in Duluth would be a fantastic place to go get a beer this weekend, don't yeah. you think? Ooh. Ken said it's going to be hot there this Ye weekend. Oh, yes, it will be. It's Saturday from 3.30 to 7 at Bayfront Festival Park uh, in the Duluth Harbor. You can enjoy unlimited samples from over 90 breweries and brew pubs of the Minnesota Craft Brewers Guild. They also have food, live entertainment, and music as well. Lots it's of dancing. Oh, my like. gosh. You they see that video? Like they're having a lot of fun yeah. there. So this I is going to be a fun event. Yeah, uh, 21 plus at this one. Tickets start at $65. They're only sold out online, so make sure you buy your tickets in advance and go check that out up on the North Shore. Looks fun. Next yeah. up. Uh, we are going rock even house. further, further north. north. Yeah. It'll yeah. be cooler, Ken said, mm -hmm. even further north. Oh, seriously? Yes. Like 70. Duluth, it'll be hot. Oh. He said further up the shore. This direction. Well, maybe you take a road trip to North uh, to Two Harbors this weekend because the Split Rock Lighthouse is celebrating its 114th birthday today with a Keeper's View event. This goes from 6.30 to 10 p.m. tonight. You can take a tour. Uh, you can learn about the dangers of the North Shore and the risk uh, faced by Split Rock's keepers and their families. They also have food from the Rustic Inn. Uh, and then they're also showing a movie about Split Rock. Uh, tickets start at $30 per person. There's also a beacon lighting at 9 p.m. tonight. That Neat. is probably I bet that's must. super interesting for people who are into history and just understanding how everything works there. Mm -hmm. It's such a magnific magnificent structure. So It's beautiful. Mm -hmm. uh, finally, closer to the Metro, the Great Midwest Rib Fest Rib is Fest. underway at Mystic Lake Casino Hotel in Prior Lake. It started last night, runs through Saturday. Rib competitors from around the world. Yesterday on Twin Cities Live, we had a, a competitor from Australia on the show. Nice. Yeah, so you can go check this out. It's more than just ribs, mac and cheese, desserts as well. Saturday, Chris Eggert, you're participating in this one, the Great Midwest Rib Fest World Rib Eating Championship. Can you beat the world record of 13.76 pounds of rib meat in 12 pounds? minutes? Pounds? Not yeah. even ribs. No, yeah. pounds. That's crazy. Pounds. Yeah. Measure that stuff. Yeah, that's crazy, that's, uh, huh? That's a lot. There's free outdoor concerts, too. Tonight, the band War will be performing for free. Sweet. Yeah. And Saturday, Five for Fighting takes the stage. Music starts at 6 p.m. both nights. You cannot bring outside beverages in. That includes water. Also, no lawn chairs or blankets. It's free to attend. All ages are welcome. I feel like you had a very eclectic mix, a little something yes, for did. everyone. Mm -hmm. this we went all she around did. the state. I love it, Thanks, Mike. Mike. Yeah, I'll post details for all these events. Mike just mentioned on MinnesotaLive.com, and be right back.
What's happening this weekend is presented by the Minnesota Twins. Experience Soda Summers at Target Field. Tickets are available now.